Hello and welcome back to another tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to share with you how to uh, you can run in your, your Lenovo IdeaPad or any kind of Lenovo IdeaPad series laptop. Uh, like you would like to maybe want to install, uh, reinstall in your laptop, uh, like reinstall Windows 10 or any kind of other Windows setup. But whenever you're trying to boot it within this uh, uh, USB or a CD, it is not boot up. So in this video, I will share with you how you can fix this issue. So now I am going to share with you how you can uh, enable to install a new setup for your Lenovo IdeaPad laptop within USB or CD so you can re uh, easily reinstall Windows. For that case, in Lenovo IdeaPad you will see there will be FN key and some function key. So I have to uh, click all that things. So first of all, I'm going to turn on my laptop press the power button and the same time I will click this F and key with F2 to show me the vote up option So first of all, I'm going to press this power button and then click F and F2 key to Appear me boot option here. We will see this boot menu option and here you have to click this uh, by in your keyboard uh, just a uh, right arrow key move around and then you have you will see here boot simply click enter and you will find here legacy support just simply down arrow and then hit enter again for save this in your keyboard press this fn key with the f10 key and then you will see a new screen will appear here you just click on yes and then i will again insert this uh, usb uh, which has already Windows 10 boot up. So I'm going to connect this uh, USB in my pen drive in my laptop and then I'm going to press enter. It will revoke again. I have to click F and F12 for boot up option. You will see I am click FN and boot up option. Here you can now easily select your USB, uh, USB and then press enter and then you will notice press any key to boot from CD and then you will notice that setup file will appear and now ready to go you can easily uh, install uh, your uh, new install in your laptop new windows setup or etc so that's for now thanks for watching my video see you next one peace